beloved one, I hope you are doing well. I want us to take a short reading from the book of Psalms, chapter 127. It says, if God's grace doesn't help the builders, they will labor in vain to build a house. If God's mercy doesn't protect the city, all the centuries will circle it in vain. It's really a senseless to work so hard from morning till late at night, toiling to make a living for fear of not having enough. Now God can provide. I want you to see this. It says God can provide for his devoted lovers even while they sleep. Now this tells us of the great things that we enjoy any time we come into God's presence. It tells us of the blessings we enjoy any time we are with God. And then we can do this through prayer, through the word of God, and even as we are about listening to this. So I want us to do something. We are going to like this video. So then please hit on the like button if you have not done so. This helps YouTube recommend this video out there to anyone so everyone can have access to it. Also, by doing this, you help in the spread of the gospel and of the good work of this channel. Then, don't forget to leave a comment in that comment section. Hit on that subscribe button if you haven't done so and you are new here. And then get on to the notification bell and do us the favor of tapping on it too. You are blessed and stay. The kingdom we live in is not some kingdom full of fear and timidity. It's a kingdom of power and authority. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I remember a woman came to me for counseling one time when she was about she got married newly you know and 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 that was quite some decades ago and she couldn't have a child so she went to a stream somewhere you know and all kinds of things were done for her and they told her make sure you have a daughter and before that daughter gets married make sure you return her and the woman said you may have been dead by that time he said see my son and he pointed one small boy who was just playing around he said by that time this boy will now be the priest return her so that something will be done hallelujah now the lady graduated and the women advised the mother and say madam we know you are a christian but this world we are living in just quietly go who will know just go and settle this thing and come back there are many people under all kinds of yokes who have been made to believe that once you are born again everything is over brothers and sisters it is true that in christ the old is supposed to have gone but satan will not just release you at a platter of gold it will take enforcing what christ has done for him to let you go hallelujah and pharaoh refused to let them go after nine plagues although god had given the command pharaoh refused to let them go hallelujah and then in the book of exodus he said, one more plague will I bring upon Pharaoh and upon Egypt. After that, he will let you go. One more plague. Hallelujah. I'm glad to announce to you tonight, the devil must give up on you finally. There are many women suffering barrenness. Many people suffering all kinds of sicknesses. There are many of us, we are sitting here laughing, but nothing is working in our homes. It's not like you are not, the day you just announce in the family that there is a project, that's the day everything will scatter. Let God bless the family with small resources. Everybody gets sick until the money finishes. Then they will become fine by themselves. I was diagnosed. I've shared my story. Some of you were born in nice families. They took care of you. The devil never oppressed you. That's why you have not understood the implication. I was diagnosed of a fungal infection I had no account of. Just appeared. This head you are seeing was literally rotting. And they told me hair will never grow on my head again. I know what evil. The That's why I will live every day. One of my life's mission is to give hell a headache till I transit to celebrate with Jesus Christ. Hmm. That my waking up every morning must be a nightmare to the kingdom of darkness. Hallelujah. There was nothing. This sponge, this hard sponge you scrub the back of pot with, they used it to scrub my head.
blood was coming out it was not out of wickedness it was out of frustration oh i know what wickedness looks like brothers and sisters let me tell you the students complained that i was irritating them in the dining hall and so they stopped me they banned me from going to the dining hall because i was irritating the students when it's time for food, I will give somebody my plate and beg them to please help me and collect food and I will stay alone. Ha! There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power in the name of Jesus to break every chain break every chain break every chain there was a season in my family people were dying like chickens look let me tell you something my grandfather for some of you who are around the north my grandfather they were the trustees and the founders of Church of Christ in Nigeria I come from a, a lineage of missionaries but it did not solve the problem in my family are you getting my point all the first bonds I saw the I saw the pattern they became useless people either they got a lady pregnant out of wedlock or something happened that scattered their lives and reduced them into it I what my father's elder brother died at a particular age range my father's younger brother died at that same time just thank God that by the time my father was getting around that range, we had gotten the revelation. Look, let me tell you. Doctor, Pastor Paul Enche said, this world is not a playground, it's a battlefield. If you don't adjust your mind fast, you will be in for a rude shock. Are you getting what I'm saying? I remember some years ago, someone got married hallelujah and we went for the wedding in kaduna i'll never forget this quite quite some years ago and when we went for the wedding they had a step they had a stepmother true story true story there was a stepmother and we noticed that people were dancing and dropping gifts please listen people were dropping all kinds of gifts and when they had finished you know they were about to pack the gifts we noticed that the guy's stepmother just came a small gift that looked like a a small bucket you know this bucket you put flour or sugar inside and just wrapped it and dropped it and when i looked at it another brother too saw it i said kai because we we're going to pray for the wedding gifts and i insisted that we we'll open this thing and see what is inside when we opened it what did we see a white bucket they just put a stone inside and closed it god is my witness welcome to planet earth where all kinds of people are permitted to live those who love god those who hate god and those who hate you and if you don't do anything about it they will take you to the grave hallelujah mm. many families let me tell you are suffering this mysterious sicknesses and diseases that they cannot explain just comes upon a man and a family there are some of us here you just went to the hospital for tests and they told you you have HIV. You have left, you, you lived a pure life. Hallelujah. Something has happened in the realm of the spirit. I remember somebody, I think it was here. He's on video. That he slept quietly. And in the night somebody appeared to him with a syringe and said this is HIV virus. Injected it into him and he woke up physically with HIV. I'm not scaring you. I'm letting you know that if you are not aware that this devil is not your friend. Are you getting what I'm saying? Somebody suffers in school. You now finish school. You go and serve. You graduated with first class or two and five years down the line. There's no decent job. No decent job. You want a job. The manager is saying you know what to do. And now you want to keep your Christian integrity. But you don't know how to command the forces of darkness to bow. You now announce in your family that God is calling me to be a pastor. 
from that day your whole life is tied into pieces everything you do does not work brothers and sisters i don't celebrate satan and evil but i'm letting you know there is evil in this world right now but there is power in the name of jesus there is power it's in the name of jesus there is power in the name of jesus it's to break every chain break every chain hallelujah i shared with us the testimony brothers and sisters if not that i saw this woman i would think it's a lie i've heard about it but i i was to i was to experience it for myself a woman who gave birth to a dead baby that came out half man half monkey half man half monkey with hair if not that i was sitting face to face with this woman if i had another man of god say it i may join those saying this is a lie some exaggeration just to make the message look powerful i've seen all kinds of evil But in the name that is above all names there is an authority that must command the forces to bow see this is what happens to people and you find out that one breakthrough will just open every area of your life are you seeing many of us are struggling you are trying to fight your health you are trying to fight this whereas there is a root problem if that problem is not dealt with you may be healed, but it will appear as something else. I hope you know that every believer is likened to a tree. How do you make a tree healthy? Do you clean the leaves? You add fertilizer at the root. How do you destroy a tree? You deal with the root. The Bible says the righteous is like a palm tree. Is that true? This is the mystery of total breakthrough. You must see every man like a tree. You waste your time trying to remove the leaves at once. When you address the problem, it's like somebody who is complaining of headache, but the real issue is typhoid fever. You can take Panadol again and again. You will receive temporary relief. But tonight, some things will be totally settled in the name of Jesus Christ. You will find out one area of your life and then marriage opens up. Then job opens up. Then your academic opens up. And that's when you say, goodness. So this is it. A dear lady of ours even while i was in abuja last week I, I met with her this lady had worked for four years very hard working lady she was here i remember that time is on video also one fair lady that came from abuja and i prayed for her this lady for four years she had been working no promotion no benefits no nothing every area of her life was grounded i prayed for this lady and she went back to abuja and her boss looked at her he said come you've been working in this place what has been done for you right now this lady follows the boss and travels with him everywhere when her friends heard about it they say it's because you are fine she says have i not been here four years with the same pretty face nothing changes by itself till you force it to change it will change one day is a dream if you force it it will change are you getting what i'm saying there are many of us you are standing outside students you are you are suffering Things are not working. People think you are dull, but you are not dull. You enter the exam hall, you blank out. And then you will do tutorials and be helping others. When they are marking scripts, your script gets missing. The wickedness. The Bible says, while men slept, an enemy came and planted tears in the wheat and ran away. There are all kinds of people, lumps, fibroids, barrenness, cysts, all kinds of nonsense all around. Until you know the might of God, you will keep getting afraid of Satan. But when you know who God is, you will know once and for all that this devil, he was created and that he can submit to the authority of his creator. Who am I speaking to tonight? Is your season for real change. You can see, 
you can sit down and watch others there are many of our sisters here as you're sitting down right now it's not like you are not pretty it's not like you are not virtuous you have done everything you have read every book you've knelt down for every man to greet them but no marriage something is wrong it even becomes a terrible situation when it's the man that doesn't have a wife to marry and this is it's easy to understand for the ladies because they position themselves to be found what of the man hallelujah But the Lord prepared this apostolic and prophetic platform to end these assaults of darkness in our lives. Listen, many of us are the only saviors of our parents right now and our families. You know we believe in family in this place, right? Your salvation is not complete until the members. He said, as for me and my house. Hallelujah. Every one of us standing here came from a family. And let me tell you, no matter how blessed you are, if your family is not changed. For many years, my father was grounded at his place of work. His juniors were being promoted. Everything was working for others except him. This man was almost dying of high blood pressure. And one day I got angry and we had to settle the issue. Tonight, God will settle some family. So, please take what I'm saying seriously. I'm speaking like this because shortly we are going to pray. Hallelujah. There are some of you, anytime somebody wants to bless you, something will happen to that person and just scatter him. Somebody says, I want to bless your family. Everything becomes grounded. There are some of us who are in ministry. You have done everything you know. Groundbreaking, prophetic match round everything nothing is growing but jesus christ brought us here tonight so that we can experience his victory hallelujah and in a few minutes we have to pray before i begin to minister brothers and sisters i want you to pray and say father visit me i didn't just come to watch others and clap hallelujah the power of god is present to heal no matter what the sickness is no matter what the sickness is believe is it cancer is it hiv is it fibroid is it genotype issue no matter what it is you are stranded in whatever area of your life please position yourself because god is about to do mighty things right now no matter how far you are inside or outside talk to the lord don't be joking this is about your destiny this is your chance for exchange of story say lord i'm tired i'm tired of clapping for others lord visit me i want to make progress in my life but there are forces that tie me down lord is the season where you will increase my greatness i'm tired of this terminal disease tired of this cancer they've told me i have days to live i'm tired of walking on a wheelchair i'm tired of this blindness tired of this deafness tired of this sickle cell anemia jesus you died and already paid the price you paid the price already oh yes jesus paid the price with his blood he paid the price already it was paid in full he paid the price for that cancer to live he paid the price for that hiv to dry up he paid the price for that barren womb to be fruitful he paid the price he paid the price go ahead and pray and say jesus you have paid the price jesus you have paid the price for the deliverance of my family we are tired of this hardship it's not your will for us to continue in this hardship and Lord, like Jacob, we hold on to you tonight. 
we will not let you go till you change our story come on pray koinonia we will not let you go those outside are you praying lord change my story academically i'm tired of writing charm again and again and again and again and again change my story change my story you already paid the price you already paid the price oh hallelujah he has paid the price hallelujah he paid it with the blood of jesus the blood of jesus is the price the price the devil must let you go the blood has been shed already jesus said it is finished that cancer is finished hiv is finished the devil may not want to let you go but you will enforce the word the bible says how forcible are right words how forcible are right words how forcible rise up on your feet everybody and begin to blast in tongues and say my time has come my time has come oh god my time has come tonight you will visit me as your blessing man let your eyes see me oh god as your changing stories visit me visit me visit me visit me visit me oh god that epilepsy must die tonight that yoke of financial hardship hallelujah hallelujah i believe hallelujah hallelujah the power of god is in this place i believe lord i believe listen 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 let me tell you something hallelujah the man who laid down at bethesda he'd been like that for 38 years there is a way a situation has been so long in your life even when they are telling you god would change it you say lord change the rest tonight do not leave any stone unturned are you getting my point whatever it is you're trusting god for many of us left different states many of us left different local governments i like you to pray and say lord for this and that and that area of my life he must give way to yes lord it must give way tonight it must give way. The power of God is already moving across this place. Goodness. Oh, she hallelujah hallelujah listen powers that hold your hands and tie your destiny must let you go hallelujah i see miracle everywhere miracle everywhere I see miracles everywhere right now, right miracles. We see miracles. Lord, we see miracles right now. 
Hallelujah. Please lift your hands. Listen, listen, listen to me. I tell you there is a strong spirit of faith in this place. Listen, listen, please listen to me first. Many of you will be surprised what will happen to you right now. Hallelujah. God is going to the root of people's issues. It's not just sickness or this. Please believe me. The, the Lord kept telling me this again and again. The root, the root of the issue. Hallelujah. Lift your hands. I'm about to pray right now. I'm about to pray inside and outside. There will be such a release of the forcible power. You can't stand it. No. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of your son, there are forces of darkness that are responsible for the tears of many people and families. And Lord, in the name of Jesus, as we shout that name, let there be such a move, my God. My God, lift your hands. At the count of three, I'd like you to shout the name Jesus. As you shout that name, devils will leave right now. One, two, three. The power of God right now. I command forces, forces of darkness, yokes, yokes of darkness, yokes, bring them out. The fire of God is falling. I challenge altars. Outside, the power of God is falling outside. Lift your hands. The devil must let you go tonight. Lift your hands. Hallelujah. I see a number of people inside and outside, and I see chains all over you. Chains. As you shout this name, it's already happening to people right now. As I speak, as I shout that name, Jesus. When you shout it, many of you will hear sounds of physical chains dropping. Are you ready now? At the count of three. One, two, three. Jesus! I give the chains. Those outside, lift your head. Just those outside. Those outside, lift your head. Hallelujah. I see the angels of the Lord moving outside. Lift your hands. Those outside, you're going to shout Jesus. There will be such a move of fire, physical fire outside. Are you ready now? Those outside. One, two, three. Go, 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 go.
Hallelujah. Lift your hands. The spirit of delay. 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 The Lord is talking to me now. Hallelujah. The power of God will fall on certain people. Straight up. God is killing the spirit of delay. And I see this row. The angel of the Lord is standing upon this row. Right now in the name of Jesus. The spirit of delay. Across this row. Go, 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 I cause delay. I cause delay. I cause delay. Samata, Iparata, Limato Paria Catoda, Sipa Pata, Sign up. Sign up. Sign up. Sign up. Gabriel. 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 Please, let's save time. The Lord is showing me witchcraft. This is serious witchcraft. Gabriel, outside. That guy is outside. You are wearing something like green. Greenish, like flowery something. Green. Where is that? You, do you know me? Come and stand here. Your, 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 time, your time has come. Please stand up. Stand up. Let's save time. I give the chains. The chains falling. Take a papa and crete pati de le bosho taba ko patalaba let her go now you are a devil of darkness release her family now release her family now release her family now i do the chase hallelujah look at me my brother i need to pray for you there's nothing working in your life. Is that true? Look at me. Absolutely nothing. People just see you and see you dressing well. There is not financial. Nothing is working. Look at me. You are a sincere person. Are you getting my point? You have cried. You have cried. There's nothing you have not done. But tonight, God wants to change your story. Bring that lady. Because I see her going through the same thing this guy is going through. Bring her. Let her go now and forever. In Jesus' name. Go! To break every chain. Break every chain. My brother, in the name of Jesus Christ, I prophesy to you. Look at me will so change and turn around in your life you will be surprised you believe this father let it be done in the name of jesus christ i'm seeing military uniform who is a soldier who is a soldier around you i'm seeing this i live in the barracks you live in a barrack because i'm seeing military uniform hallelujah god is going to help you Huh? You need the help of God. You have gotten to a point where you have done the best by yourself. It will take God to help you. Hallelujah. Victoria. 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 The Lord is showing me a name, Victoria. We may not call everybody Victoria. Victoria. Ah. Well. I believe when God speaks to one, he speaks to all. Where's the person I was talking to? He has gone? I've not finished, my brother. Hallelujah. 
come. We are going to break the curse. This, this is, I'm saying, this is, this is a yoke of darkness. Please hold my hands. Father, in the name of Jesus, we break this evil right now. <sighs> Madam, I'm looking at you, but I'm seeing a man. I'm not seeing a woman. I'm looking at you, I'm seeing a man. The power of God is going to come upon a lady now. There will be a loud shout. Let me have that lady here. It's going to happen right now. There is a strong force of the spirit. It will, it will be so strong upon the person. Please, when that happens... Break every chain. Look at me. I'm going to pray for you. Please, I want you to believe. Hallelujah. Come, sister. Just those who came out, don't take them back. Just, just leave them. Hold my hands. Out of her. Go. Go in the name of Jesus Christ. Devil of darkness. Father, I pray for all of the people. My brother. I didn't pray for you, that was why. Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray, change his story in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. I'll just lay hands on you people. I don't know what the issue is, but as I lay hands, I'm seeing a man. Huh? I want to pray for you. Please, because this thing has tied your life down. Lord, let her be free in the name of Jesus. Let her be free in the name of Jesus. Please, if I pray for you, just go back. Change their story, so God, in the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever reason you brought them out, change their stories. As I lay my hands on you, I want you to know that everything is over in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. A drama will be acted in this place shortly now. Look up. Hallelujah. The Lord is asking me to release marriages. This is it. It will start answering from this lady. It will start moving across right now. The power of God will start touching people. I'm about to pray. I've not prayed yet. It will start touching ladies, especially ladies. In a strange way, God is releasing marriages supernaturally. Supernaturally. This way, just like this. Just like this down. That's how I see the power of God moving. Lift your hand. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Every cause of marital delay. Lift up people now. 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 Every cause, bring them out. Bring them out. Every spirit stopping marriages by the fire of the Holy Ghost. Every spirit stopping marriages. Go protect it. Outside. God has outside. I break the curse. 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 I the Hallelujah. Listen to me. The Bible says male and female, he created them. Not male and male. Not female and female. Lift your hands. In the name that is above all names. If there is any family here that their marital destiny has been tied down as surely as the Lord God of Israel lives right now 
may the fire of the Holy Ghost move and cause deliverance right now. Every spirit husband, every spirit wife, every devil, every demon, go, go, by the fire of the Holy Ghost. Every heart of witchcraft that has tied families, we release you right now. Hallelujah. Goodness. God is setting families free. Oh, the devil must give up on you tonight. Yes, he will. Yes, he will. Hallelujah. That girl on red, tying red scarf, there is an angel pouring oil on her right now. Right now, I cause that spirit. Go, go out of her right now. In the name of Jesus. That's right, that's the lady. In the name of Jesus, the power of God is coming upon her right now. Go, go, go. Release her right now. Release her right now. Release her right now. Release her right now. Hallelujah. Listen. I want you to know you mustn't manifest and do all these things. God is just setting people free. Are you getting my point? I like us to just flow with what God is doing right now. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. The Lord is showing me a lady. I'm seeing a lady. You had a dream and a dog pursued you and beat you. Please, who is that person? I, I like us to save time, please. I may not talk to everybody, but we still have a lot of things to do. Please, hurry up. Who is that person? One, if it's if you are thinking about it, just remain on your seat, please. This is not guesswork. This is what the Holy Spirit, because we have to pray for the sick. You're going to be free right now. You're going to be free right now. I give the chains. The chains for you. Please hold my hand. It ends right now, oh Lord. It ends. Release her right now. Release her right now. That power of darkness. Let her go. In Jesus' name. Please come, let me pray for you. I break that demonic thing over your life. In the name of Jesus. I break that demonic thing over your life. In the name of Jesus. That demonic thing over your life. In the name of Jesus Christ. We break that demonic thing over your life in the name of Jesus look at me your family is not even you now you are a worker in this house and as a worker you are entitled to certain blessings huh? your family there is a cause of hardship upon your family your entire family hold my hands you must be free right now let her go representing her family in the name of Jesus, I plead the blood. What is this that I see in the spirit? You must let her go. Because she's a faithful worker in this house. In the name of Jesus. Out of her. In the name of Jesus Christ. I release your family. I release your family. I release your family. In the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord is showing me the vision of a tree. And I'm seeing it tied with ropes tied with ropes this is what I'm seeing in the spirit is tied and this is like the destiny of this family and they've done everything to tie it but I release it right now I release it by the spirit in the name of the Lord Jesus and I prophesy on everybody whatever the devil has tied the destiny 
of any family that has been tied be released now 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 every destiny that has been tied by witchcraft go protect be released now Hallelujah. 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 I tell you the breakthroughs that are happening. Many of you will leave this place. You will be surprised. Just believe me. There is somebody outside two people in fact the fire of god will rush upon them right now in a mighty and strange way they will never be able to contain it outside when that happens let me have those people if two people in a powerful way is happening right now by the spirit you can't stand it you will just be standing and it will come on you in a wild way like fire like wildfire it will come upon you please let me have the ladies like wildfire it will turn you you will be running it will happen to you you will be running around you will be running around there is power in the name of jesus there is power in the, in the name, name of Jesus. Jesus. There is power in, in the name, name of Jesus. Jesus. In the name of Jesus. To break every chain. Break every chain. To break every chain. Hallelujah. Who is Salome? There is a wild spirit in this lady's family. This lady you are seeing. Let her go now. This is Benway State. In the name of Jesus, release this family now. Release this family now. Hallelujah. Salome. The meaning of your name in your language is like treasure. Treasure or something precious. Who is that? Like treasure. Or don't tell lies here, oh, please. You are the one? What is, what's your name? No, no, Salome, just wait here. You are the one? Salome. The, the meaning of your name I'm going to pray for you Salome where's your mother she's at home where we need to pray God wants to give your family breakthrough out of her now out of her out out right now out out of her out bring them she parata barigete bragete boksha ni baso paria tabaria doste ke barata ta i prato se palia na bako se ke de bragadia reteste barata bako se ke de ba si banda bako i set your family free right now by the fire of the holy ghost now be free now be free now be free out out be free in the name of the lord jesus may you become that treasure truly 
let your days of crying come to an end in the name of Jesus Christ hallelujah hallelujah please rise up I want us to pray I'm seeing a lecturer that is going to die next week if we don't pray he's going to die hallelujah I'm not I'm not a prophet of doom God just interrupted this please stand up in one minute I'd like us to pray before we continue and say we refuse death I'm seeing a professor dying next week Lord, we plead the blood. We plead we plead the blood of God. We plead the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. We are going to pray for the sick right now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Those of you who came with people who are sick, it's time to minister to them right now. Hallelujah. Now, please listen. I know that there are a lot of people and we want to do it very, very fast. I'm sorry we don't take too much time to announce instant miracles now you know we are bounded by time if we're doing an afternoon program we can take so many things hallelujah so I want it's not like we're not celebrating what God is doing it, it would have been easy now to just ask these people to testify to encourage us but we don't have all of that time now there are so many people there are people after this meeting now may return to certain places hallelujah please and please please and please we don't fake miracles in this place we don't we believe in the power of God I know that many people have come trusting God for healing and I know that some of us have come with our loved ones hallelujah praise God please I want us to be orderly in this place no fighting no nothing by the grace of God we're going to minister to everybody one by one hallelujah praise God so please and please, I want you to cooperate with us. Hallelujah. The worship team will lead us in a powerful worship song while we allow those who are sick. You came with someone sick or you are sick. Now is your time to walk up to the front. Come and stand and trust Jesus for a miracle. And make sure you are writing your prayer request if you don't have any prayer request. Hallelujah. Please. If it's someone that cannot stand, maybe if there's a way protocol can help the people and then maybe we can have a chair or something whatever it is Jesus Christ those of you standing lift your hands and begin to thank God for the miracles of people please pray please pray his presence is to him oh hallelujah we give you praise those of you coming out please begin to pray and say lord my time has come i know you have all kinds of medical reports forget about them right now hiv cases cancer cases whatever it is genotype don't worry jesus is lord in this place lord we thank you please let's save time if you've not written your prayer request start writing it his presence is here. His presence is here to heal. His presence is here. Let your faith rise. Lord, my time has come. I'm not going back the same. From headache to infection, no matter how little. 
Oh, hallelujah. Jehovah Rapha. There is a God that heals in the house. So heal. One more time. One more time. Jesus heals. Jesus heals. You will be delivered. I don't care what the situation is. To heal, to heal. For I am Lord. The healing team. His presence is here to heal. To heal. Son of man, can this bone? Hallelujah. I want you to know whatever the situation is, there is a God. We are not against doctors. We have doctors here as workers. But let me tell you, it gets to a point in your life where you have done your best. When you have done your best, leave it all to Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus Christ. We are going to pray for you. Hallelujah. Listen. I want you to believe in the power of the Holy Spirit as I minister to you right now. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. The anointing of the Spirit is strong and I see the angels of the Lord here. Many of you, what you call sickness is not sickness, it's witchcraft. Huh? You will be delivered from it and that will be the end of it. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. It's, when he's ready, he can come and join me. Dex is deeply in the spirit, so just let him. When he's ready, Jesus, I give you all the praise. Those of us who are there, please don't be carried away. Make sure you participate and let's trust the miracle working power. Especially those of you who God is calling you into a healing ministry. Now is the time to look. Now is the time to concentrate so that you will receive something. We give you all the praise. Make sure you go back and begin to check yourself. God is healing people. Come and see in the presence of Lord. Be healed. Hold on, please. Hold on. Hallelujah. Daddy, don't cry. What's wrong with you, sir? I, I'm suffering from arthritis since 30 years. 30 years, brothers and sisters. 30 years arthritis. Uh, and it is a sign of stroke. It gives me a sign of stroke. Is your father? Is your father? Come. What did they tell him in the hospital? Sir, he's having arthritis. He's having deep. It's not just arthritis. I'm seeing pile. I'm seeing pile. I'm seeing pile. This is witchcraft. Do you have pile? Yeah. I'm if I want to, if I want to, uh, is yourself, is it myself? The thing will be strong. That's what I'm saying. It's pile. This is pile. It's not just arthritis alone. This is pile. This is this is an evil thing. Is that pile? Yes, sir. It's having pile. You are having pile. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You too, you are having pile now. See, this is a cause to destroy everybody in your family. It's not just your father. This thing has been there since. Since. Are you getting my point? You are not the only one. You have suffered with this pile. Even you, it has embarrassed you. It's just something you cannot tell people. Because I'm seeing that if they don't help, you will start bending. It will start like your leg will start paining you. The same thing that is happening to your father will happen to you. You've done for me 
what no man can do. Jehovah, 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 you done for me. There is a name that is greater than any ancestry. You will be the first to be healed. Come, hold my hand. Pile, go now. You are a devil of darkness. I curse you out from her life in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus. Daddy. I bring you the life of Jesus Christ. The power of God is coming upon you. Stroke. I curse that spirit. I curse that spirit. Strength to you. I curse that spirit. Look at this. In the name of the Lord Jesus, come. Stand up. Come by yourself. Come. Come. Just come. 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 Walk. Come. At this 30 years stroke 30 years stroke 30 years stroke come on now look at look at look at look at what is happening to me 30 years stroke come on give jesus praise 30 years stroke look at look at look at this man come on son hey, look at look at this Look at this, look at this, look at this, look at, look at, look at this, look at this. Hallelujah. Ah. Come on now, hold on, hold on. How many of you saw this man when he was coming? Are you seeing this now? Look at our daddy. Daddy, are you surprised? I'm surprised. What is happening to you, right? There is no penny. Completely. Hey. Look at, look at this. Come on, give Jesus praise. 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 The spirit of God is upon me. Even the devil on, knows celebrate. that I am a winner. The spirit of God is upon me. Even the devil knows that I am a winner. The spirit of God is upon me. Even the devil knows that I am a winner. The spirit of God is upon me. Even the devil knows that I am a winner. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. You know, there are people who believe that these things are stage managed. Hallelujah. How can you stage manage a miracle with an elderly man like this? Eh? From Niger State. This is his first time coming all the way from Niger State. 30 years arthritis. Hallelujah. I prophesy to your family in the name of Jesus Christ. Everything that was lost shall be returned unto you. Everything that was stolen shall be returned unto you. In the name that is above all names, I prophesy. Just leave him. Leave him. He's just sitting down. He's, he's so excited he doesn't know what to do with himself. I cannot stand up by myself like that. Before. All right. Sit down and try it again. Sit down and try it again. You know, he couldn't stand up. Help him. Help him sit down. Try to stand up now. Look at this. Help him. Oh, hallelujah. It never returns again in the name of Jesus. Whoever is responsible for any evil, he will reap what he has sown. 
Be blessed in the name of Jesus. Give Jesus praise. Let's hurry up. Let's when God. Jesus say yes, nobody can say no. When Jesus say yes, nobody can say no. When Jesus say yes, nobody can say no. Hey! When Jesus say yes, nobody can say no. When Jesus say yes, nobody can say no. Hallelujah. Please, if you are with a little child, can you guide them so that we know what is wrong with them? Let's save time. There are a number of people. Hallelujah. Madam, look at me. This woman is going through a very serious situation. But let me tell you, it will change. I don't care what has been removed. One has been removed. They removed. Don't cry. It's okay. It's okay. What exactly did the doctor say? They didn't say anything. That I can no longer conceive. You can no longer conceive. Why? Because one has been removed and the other one is not healthy. One has been removed. The other one is not healthy. Ah, son of man, can this bones be begun? <laughs> Hallelujah. I wish this woman was here who had been burying that carried her child. I don't know if she's here. This fair lady, she's not here. Bro. I wish you were here. She would have brought the child. And let's see that medical reports can be cancelled. She's not here. Habiba's sister. Sadia's sister. She's not here. That one. Is she around? Come. Come. Come with the child. Where is she? Come with the child to the shame of the devil. That's a woman they say will never take in. Come with your child. That's a miracle baby there. Come. Please come, madam. Sorry, don't be embarrassed. Clear the way for her. I want to encourage you. Come. Please, kind God, oh, I never see in kind, oh, this kind God, oh, bless the me. Hallelujah. Name. Hold on. This, this is a woman that nothing would have been able to happen. Nothing completely. But look at the fine boy. See, look, let me tell you. There is nothing that ends argument like results. You can fake a headache. Can you fake a child? Hallelujah. Madam, let me tell you the truth. You will not only carry a child, you will carry plenty of people. Please believe. I, I, I brought her out to show you when they gave birth to this baby, this baby was looking like an angel. They were snapping the baby, right? Hallelujah. Father, every woman in this place, every family, trusting God for a miracle child, in the name that is above all names, you did it for this family, do it again. Do it again, oh God. Do it again, oh God. Hallelujah. Madam, you'll be free right now. Look at me. I don't care whether one womb has been removed or whether another one is not working. It's irrelevant. All I know is you will have children and they will grow in wombs. Where it will come, that is not my responsibility. Are you getting my point now? The child is in it. Something will leave you now. This is this is demonic. Let this woman go now. I command that you get pregnant. Give birth to miracle children. We create new wombs right now. In the name of Jesus Christ. It is done. You will return with your miracle children. I 
I'll attend to everybody now. We'll be very, very fast so that we can save time. Worship team, please. My God is awesome. He can move my Hold on. Let her talk. Yaro nane aje Israel. Aje Israel zin. She she ena aiki the Nigeria Christian Progress Commission, Abuja. So se suka kefi ya lidi ni ya ni sao sao. Se ya ni edo guda hudu sinje sun dukeshi. Suka chile shi de ke fourth floor. Sun yet de sha kasa. Suka karba kudi a wajen shi. Tun di zeba fourteen. Ena pama a Israel. She ne asa na che. Am I naiki enzu? Hari enzu? Am I enzu? Look at you, they are fadi. I check with that you bungan about, with that you rubutuba, with that you take fear about. Ogasi, I check to a chick about the truth in this. I do a lay a gay machine. There you take fear. There you mugana. There you rubutu. So now, yes, so you're doing a rubutu. You're not mugana. I'm a cup of the day. Father. In the name of your son Jesus Christ, all the way from Nigeria by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, what's his name? Bege, we call you now. Those, I don't care whether they are broken, whatever is wrong with it. Receive life now. Receive life now. We command you to stand up from that dead bed. Stand up from that dead bed now. Your hands will write, your eyes will see, your feet will walk. Every broken bone, we mend it now. Thank you, Jesus. Mama, you will return with a testimony. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. And I pray for you. Now get you on buyer. Hold on. Buying can make his office sometimes go. Your back. Come and get the cafe. Hurry as well. Yeah. At the kafa, they call it senyin kashi abi in Aosa. That's what rheumatism. I'm going to pray for you. We we'll pray. We we'll soon get interpreters. Aosa, Baju, anyone. English, I hear Baju. Everyone. What's that? Your song? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. That's what. That's baggy. Ah, hold on. Come on, Sam. But can you walk and Kadunaba? Hold on now. Young Kadunaba, can you walk and get in Cuba? You don't know what they are saying, just be just with them. Hallelujah. Mommy be healed of rheumatism now. In the name of Jesus, I cause that pain. Right now in your legs, be healed. Stand up. Come. 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 In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Strength to your leg. I cause it. Pain go. Walk, man. Walk. 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 Look at this. Walk. Look at this. Any, any improvement on your leg? Look at, look at. Rheumatism. Couldn't walk well on one leg. In the name of Jesus Christ, it becomes permanent, completely permanent. In Jesus' name, and your son is healed and he will return. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. God bless you.
We have to hurry up. Sam, sing something else, please. My God is awesome. He can move mountain. Keep me in the valley. Hide me from the rain. My God is awesome. Heals me when I'm broke. Strength where I'm collecting the prayer request very quickly start collecting the prayer request very quickly
with all kinds of pain. But in the name of Jesus, the pain is gone. Daddy, I want you to take a step of faith to walk. Leave him. Just support him, but leave him. Make sure, you, don't worry, you won't fall, Daddy. They are standing at your back. Try to turn and walk. Look at this. I could not use this knee before because of arthritis for six weeks. Very painful. But look at I've been able to move it. The pain my is gone. <laughs> the pain is gone. The pain is gone. Don't worry, Daddy. Don't look at the pain. Just look at me. Just look at me. Walk. Follow me. Forget about the leg. Just look at me. Just look at me. Don't take your eyes away from me. I cause evil. In the name of Jesus Christ, try to lift the leg. Try to lift it now. Don't worry, you won't fall. Lift it. Lift it. Look at. Lift it. Lift it, Daddy. Lift it. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Try walking, sir. Father, you have begun this. It, it is perfected. Me, I cause the spirit that sponsors evil. Because this is witchcraft. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. And by the mercy of the son of the living God. I command this spell. From the crown of your head daddy. To the sole of your feet be healed. I command the knee, the ankles. In the name of Jesus Christ. Be made whole. In Jesus name. You will not fall. They are supporting you. Please don't be afraid. Just follow me. Come. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Just look at me. Look at me. Look at me, sir. Look at me. Now come. Come. Just come. Just come. 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 Look at this. Come on now. Koinonia celebrate Jesus. He's walking by himself. Don't worry. You will not fall. They are supporting you. Just come. Just come. Leave them that walk by yourself. Come. Come. Thank you, Jesus. Come. Come on, Koinonia. He's walking by himself.
chain is breaking, breaking. breaking. whatever it is, wherever it is, it's breaking, yeah, breaking, it's breaking, yeah, breaking, and it's falling, it's falling, it's bowing, bowing. Hallelujah. I know we're out of time. Please turn the prayer request. If you've not written your prayer request, those online, they should connect with us. We want to pray right now. Hallelujah. God is setting people free. Please don't miss the prophecy after this because it's very, very important. Hallelujah. God is going to be... If you've not submitted your prayer request, please do that. Just wave your hands and the ushers will come to you quickly. Please, one minute, one minute. One minute. Let's do this quickly. All those connecting with us, um, through the internet, they can just connect by faith. Hallelujah. Pastor Jakes will lead us to this session. Praise the Lord. If you can rise, please rise. This is a very prophetic moment. Look at me. Hold on. We're not just doing this foolishly. This is an instruction God gave us. Hallelujah. We've had unspeakable testimonies. I believe almost everybody, this is summary of your prayer request. We may not have time to deal with it. This, please, don't make it ritualistic. Hallelujah. The Bible says Hezekiah took the threat letter and took it to the temple and he dropped it before God. Stretch your hands and begin to pray as Pastor Jakes leads us through this. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I want, I want you to pray. We're going to be laying our hands on this request right now. And I'm telling you, God is going to be releasing miracles. You're standing, I'd like you to pray and say, Lord, this is it. Everything I've written here lives my life. Everything that needs to come into my life, please pray. Participate in the meeting. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Go ahead, Queen Tongues. Shele braka to la mane mang dosi prega la 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 boko so para bala braka la 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 ba dosi mbara la 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 boko so para ya da 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 baka shanda da braka la 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 da boko so pega da pega da rata bala 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 Rata tapaya rava la brada la bala 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 in no se i kapari onde in do o pari ala kabao se i la baha re i kapa on se i kapa na kada li i no se i ma kong se i ne panda ma pre kong se prenda kong de i ri i pari on se i la ha ri no se i para i o se i la ka i la ha mi a dash ka i na tanda kong de mi e kong ka i na kanda ba ha ra kan se o i la ha na kong de Si que pan bro y acá Mi amor se y le canto Y le pan bro de pie Entonces y capaz de él Raquia pateria Arroz de aquí está aviando Y le está Sees us with his eyes of mercy, he answers our prayers speedily. Lord, your grace, 
I see the angels of God come like flash of light, real fast, bringing answers to prayers. For some of us, we will receive calls even tonight. Answers, answers, answers to prayers. Ah, just like Hezekiah opened us his prayers before the Lord. And right before the prophet left the temple, answers came. The answers come tonight in the name of Jesus. The answers come tonight in the name of Jesus. The Lord brings healing. Aha. Thank you, blessed Lord. Bakos i perioto shimile gambrong siki parodo sile branda karabadose. There's a particular case of consistent pain on your ankle, the right ankle. That person wrote it as a prayer request. The Lord is healing that in the name of Jesus. Father, we lay these prayer points before you. The God of all flesh, the God of all spirits, Abba Father. God, you are greater than our challenges. You are bigger than every problem we have. We ask you, blessed Father, let the seal of your spirit be upon these prayers in the name of Jesus. Let the seal of Jesus, the power of his blood, speak in the name of Jesus. We cause doors to open in the blessed name of Jesus. We command breakthroughs in the name of Jesus. Let answers come speedily by your spirit in the name of Jesus. For every heart cry, every pain, the Lord wipes away tears in the name of Jesus. Father, we give you praise for every prayer point here, Lord, is sealed in the name of Jesus. It is answered in the name of Jesus. We give you the praise, we give you the glory, for we pray in the blessed name of Jesus. And we decree, we declare that we are blessed and our answers have come. In the blessed name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we pray. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. I have waited for this moment to come. Go back, back to the way it used to be before your presence came and changed me. I won't go back. I won't go back. Can't go back to the way it used to be before your presence came and changed me. So tonight. I want you to believe Jesus told us something he said as my father has sent me with the same assignment and the same equipping let's look at that scripture oh hallelujah 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 Come on, just pray in tongues for one minute. Something just entered my spirit. As my father has sent me with the same equipping, with the same equipping. John 20. John 20. John 20. Ah! Goodness. John 20. Are you there? Then said Jesus to them, listen, peace be to you as my father has sent me. He said, even so send I you. So he showed us the very next verse how the father sent him. That means he equipped me. The father did something to me. And I'm about to do the same thing to you. And it will make you do the works that he did. Watch this. 22. 
and when he had said this he breathed on them he said this is the secret receive ye the holy ghost receive ye the holy ghost i transfer the ministry of the holy spirit from me to you let him walk with you and you will do wonders you will suddenly become a priest you will suddenly become a king the same way i set men free he will empower you and you will set men free the same way i spoke and it came to pass now the same way the holy ghost walked with me this was my secret receive ye receive that means you can reject him he said receive don't reject him receive when he comes to you receive his presence makes you become like jesus it's not about praying in tongues it's more than praying in tongues you receive him you can reject him jesus said when he comes receive receive don't reject many people have been rejecting him you are praying in tongues but you've been rejecting him tonight receive him receive him receive his ministry jesus said when he comes receive the holy ghost receive the holy ghost receive the holy ghost receive the holy ghost the same way you receive a visitor question how do you receive a visitor in your house when a visitor comes you put a chair you say you are welcome let me bring food for you what do you want that's how to receive you don't stand at the door and say mr man what did you come to look for that's how many of us are receiving the holy ghost you are praying in tongues but you truly have not received his ministry tonight will you receive that ministry will you receive the same way you receive a visitor the bible says be careful entertain men well for in need some of you have entertained strangers that's why you see us honor his presence so much because jesus left him without the holy spirit while i was praying i said holy spirit we're in partnership with you i will do the talking i will do all the things my own part of the deal i will do it well and i know for sure that's what gives us confidence to announce that people will be healed that's what gives us confidence there is an audacity there is always a side to your life you cannot explain that's the side where the holy ghost steps in if you can explain everything about your life you are walking alone there should be a supernatural dimension i've explained to you the part of the meeting that can be explained the other part now the holy ghost does not just talk he explains it with the results oh that's why i love him doesn't have room for long stories tonight god is giving someone another opportunity to raise a cry of dissatisfaction and say lord i'm tired the worship team sang it beautifully they said i'm tired of the status quo tonight there are many of us here who may be wondering but what is wrong with my life i've not done anything wrong what you need is an appointment by prophecy the bible says to appoint unto them that mourn in zion to give them beauty for ashes the oil of gladness for the spirit of heaviness it says that they may be called the oaks of righteousness the planting of the lord that he might be glorified we're going to pray the lord has showed me of his presence in a mighty way to heal especially for the sick you must get angry this night and say lord i'm not going back with that situation see don't get too used to it the same way you receive the holy spirit reject certain things hallelujah let me show you one scripture back to our text john 9 let me tell you what can happen to you when you don't open up your heart to receive john chapter 9 while i was reading today i had to stop and say goodness so this thing did not start now two things can happen to you if you do not position yourself to receive number one 9 verse 16 listen to what happened we have been accusing very innocent people around our society 
because we are not open to receive john 9 verse 16 are you ready read therefore said some of the pharisees okay this man is this is jesus they are talking about are you getting my point now they saw somebody receiving a fantastic miracle they saw this man getting blessed and now they were frustrated because this thing was not just working what kind of power is it there are probably some of you here who have heard of the things that god is doing and probably you just came to watch and see let me verify for myself look at it it didn't just start today satan always wants to discredit people who are doing the things that god has asked them to do he said this man is not of god because he keepeth not the sabbath day what kind of silly excuse is that look at the excuse they were bringing those people lose their cattle they lose their cattle be careful lest you allow the devil cheat you by putting a very doubtful heart and you keep looking and say are miracles really real do people really get healed is it true it's a big shame that when people are healed we associate it most of the time to witchcraft power so we agree that witches and wizards can heal and then we are saying the lord of glory cannot heal verse 18 Oh, oh, oh. but the jews did not do what the jews did not believe concerning him that he had been blind that's another thing so you either say the man of god is not a genuine man of god or the miracle that happened is not genuine that's what they said they said we don't believe that the man has been born blind and received his sight until they called his parents so you can watch people ss genotype in your presence chain and he said there's no way i'm studying medicine or i'm a doctor this thing cannot happen or you watch somebody holding a crutch get healed or somebody blind or deaf or someone oppressed liberated and you say just like that just like that what are you doing are you seeing two things can happen when your heart is not open to receive you can sit down and keep doubting this man of god is he using something If it's easy to get the something get it how many of you remember one gentleman called sadiq ibrahim i never knew it was so difficult to get power from the kingdom of darkness until that guy came he came to give some of you were around that miracle service this guy was a terrorist he was a terrorist he was part of the people that trained those who fought for post-election violence and he came was dying of hiv right dying of tuberculosis he had slept in the grave three days he said he could enter a church and look at a man of god and blow this whatever magic portion and the man of god would just get confused on the stage so he came for koinonia just like this and he was sitting outside hallelujah as soon as i came up on stage when he saw people falling he said there's power in this place whether there's witchcraft power or god's power there is power in this place because he knows what it means the kind he went to sleep in the grave for three days murdered little children and used their blood for sacrifice so that guns will not enter his body just for that little thing see the sacrifice you think it's easy to get power from satan get it hallelujah that guy was there he's on video as soon as i stepped on stage he said as soon as i came on stage all he saw was light and fire and that was the end of it he didn't even know when he collapsed then i called him by word of knowledge and i said he should come he's on video go and watch it right there he was healed of hiv he was healed of tuberculosis the results were there i mean some of you we then we used to meet also there he testified he gave his testimony it was verified it shocked him that was when he made up his mind they were still looking for him to kill him brothers and sisters the power of god exists miracles still happen 
I know that many of you believe, but you have not received that reality that your situation can change. Tonight, I believe God for somebody. Let's trust God together. Let's trust God together. Let's trust God together and say, Lord, it can change. It can change. That genotype can change. They refuse to allow you marry because you are SS. That genotype can change. That genotype can change. You must not understand how everything can happen. The Bible says, just as you do not know how bones are formed in the womb of how a child, not the way of the wind. That's how you do not know the work of God. There are certain dimensions that are inexplainable. Hallelujah. Selena is here. Where is Selena? Wave your hand. I think it was her auntie that that one time we prayed for. She had triplets, right? Or something. The children are still alive. Triplets. One, two, three. Three children. I just felt a need to clear this air. Because some of you come with all kinds of cynical spirits. And you have problems that are killing you. But rather than opening your heart, you are there just wondering. Is God really the one doing this? Can somebody just fall down like that without being touched? Is it really true? Is it real? It's not your fault. It's the way some of us were raised. You don't have to be angry. Listen, listen. When you ever hear a man criticizing a man of God, don't blame the person. Never insult the person. They are only talking that while we were insulting Jesus Christ on the cross. What did he do? He said, Father, forgive them. Forgive them. Never find yourself trying to defend yourself. No, no. It's not part of your ministry. The psalmist said in Psalm 3, Thou, O Lord, art a shield for me. He says, You are my glory and the lifter up of my head. I always tell people, Gamaliel spoke beautifully. He said, If it is of God, no man can stop it. If it is not of God, it will fail. There's no one beside you. I lead the earth to worship you. Who is there like you? There's no one beside you. I lead the earth to worship you. I lead the earth to worship you. Hallelujah. Lord Jesus change our situations tonight there are many of us as you're sitting looking at me right now the problem that you have is only God that can help you because the load is too much are you getting me there are some of you it's like I see you in the hospital your situation right now is a matter of life and death your own is just it's not just admission maybe there is a terminal disease I remember a particular lady I was talking to. I think she might be somewhere here. A herbalist predicted her death today. Today, this 25th. The herbalist predicted that it's today that she would die. So when I got to hear about it, I said, interesting. Come and die here. Hallelujah. Just come and die here. There is a rod of a higher priesthood. There is a rod of a higher priesthood. Is there anything too hard for me to do? I am that I am. That's what God is asking somebody tonight. Is there anything too hard for me to do? I am that I am. Is there anything to want for me to do? I am that I am.
times oh, the Lord is talking to you is there anything to what for me to do I am that I am for the last time now prophesy is there Rise up on your feet and begin to prophesy. I believe you. Oh, I believe, I believe, I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe. Everywhere. Inside and outside. Connect. This is the moment of faith. I'm about to step back. And let this most Holy Spirit step into your life is there anything too hard for me to do i am that i am is there anything for me to do I am that I am Come on, celebrate the God of miracles oh, oh, oh. Hey, hey. Is there anything You want for me to do Too hard for me to do I am that I am I am that I am hey. Is there anything Is there anything So hard for you to do Too hard for him to do. I am that I am. Is there anything too hard for him to do? I am that I am. Lift your hands, everybody, and let us worship him. Emmanuel, 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 your name is called Emmanuel, your name is called. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. His name is God. Emmanuel. His name is called. Listen. The Bible says, listen. It says, with God, all things are possible. With God, all things. What is not possible with God involve God. And it becomes possible that sickness will never go but with God that sickness suddenly leaves 
that situation will never change but with god that's why we are singing that song emmanuel emmanuel Hiya. emmanuel 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 His name is called Your name is called Emmanuel Hallelujah Before I minister I begin ministering Hallelujah. There are two people that God is going to visit in a very strong way. Hallelujah. Both of them are outside. Hallelujah. The power of God will come mightily upon them. I don't know what it is that God wants to do. Those outside, just lift your hands. Thank you, Jesus. I see the angels of the Lord walking outside. Two people. The power of God is coming mightily right now as I speak upon them. Please let me have them inside. Two people mightily. It's a strong spirit of prophecy in this place. Two people very mightily by the power of the Holy Ghost. His name is called... Emmanuel His name is called Emmanuel Hallelujah Those of you in this row just lift your hands I don't know what it is that I see the angels of the Lord doing here I see the angels of the Lord moving At the count of three there will be such a move of the spirit in this room. Let me have the people outside. Thank you, Jesus. One, two, three. Let the power of God move right now. Right now. Is the fire of the Holy Ghost. Emmanuel, his name is called Emmanuel, his name is called Emmanuel. His name is called Emmanuel. His name is called. Bring her. No devil will stop her. Your name is called. Your name is God. 
presence of God no demon no devil no altar I don't care what altar of darkness my altar is calling you oh God my altar is calling you oh God my secret place is calling you, oh God. My worship is calling you, oh God. My worship is calling you, oh God. Take my praise. Please lift your hands. I see the angels of the Lord moving now. Lift your hands. We're about to cause devils and wicked spirits. Please follow me, instrumentalist. We are going to cause every power. The Bible says every tree that has not been planted by my father, that tree must give way. And I come under an apostolic anointing in the name of the one whose i am and whom i serve that at the count of three any power that is not of god inside and outside at the count of three we challenge those devils by the fire of the holy ghost as you shout three the power of god will rush inside and outside and there will be massive deliverances right now are you ready now one two Three shout Jesus. Shake up a pack of Corporal Secretary. I cause powers. Every wicked power. Every demon. Every activity of darkness. I cause you now. 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 Every act of witchcraft. Secretary. By the fire of the Holy Ghost. You come under the judgment of God inside and outside right now. Let the power of God bring deliverance for upon Mount Zion there shall be deliverance. There shall be holiness and the sons of Jacob shall possess their possession. Hallelujah. Those outside, just those outside, goodness. I see a number of angels. You're going to shout Jesus after the count of three. Outside means everywhere that is not in. And there will be massive 
deliverance thank you Jesus are you ready now those outside I see the power of God like files of fire one two at the count of three shout Jesus three we dethrone altars we dethrone yokes of darkness hallelujah hallelujah blessed is he who comes in the name of our God blessed is he who comes in the name of our God those outside be sensitive there is so much power I don't know what it is but the, the power of God is so strong outside in the name of our God hallelujah thank you Lord Jesus name of our God bring the lady most high most high you're the Lord most high leave this girl in peace now go now let her go don't waste our time let her go now Bring this lady, please. I set you free. Now, out of her now, that devil of darkness. Blessed is he who comes in the name of God. Hallelujah. Please help her, ladies. It's not easy, I know. Just fine. It's time for her deliverance. Bring her. Come. Don't force her. She will come. Now. Quickly. I call you Lord most high. Don't touch her, she will come by herself. Most high. Let her go now. In the name of Jesus. By the power of the Holy Ghost, out of her now. In the name of Jesus Christ, let her go now. Thank you, Jesus. I bring you liberty. Be free now. In Jesus' name. She's free. In the name of Jesus it's over let her go now the blood of Jesus the name of Jesus Christ thank you you died for her let her go I come with the rod of a higher priesthood let her go in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ thank you father I give you all the praise she's delivered completely in the name of Jesus Christ thank you
I anoint you guys. Let the anointing of the Spirit flow through you as you minister to them. In the name of Jesus. She will go. Come, lay hands on this lady. Out of her now, thou devil of darkness. I curse you. I see you in the Spirit. Out! Out! Let her go free. Her time of deliverance is now. I speak to you, wicked spirit. Let her go now. Jesus died. Listen, let me tell you. There is no power. Listen. There is no power that will resist the power of God tonight. The Bible says, let every soul be subject to the higher powers. Have you read that in your Bible? Let every soul be subject. When it sees powers that are higher than it, it should be subject. Let every soul. Hallelujah. Esther. 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 There is an Esther that is not feeling fine. You are sick. Not just, I know there are many Esthers. The Lord is ministering to me. I don't know what is wrong with that Esther, but you need a miracle, a healing miracle. Esther. Please let's save time. There is a lot we have to do tonight. Esther. Who is Deborah? Deborah. Deborah, you are outside. That Deborah is wearing red. You are wearing red. Red with black spots. It's a shirt red with black spots. Deborah, come. Your name is Deborah. I'm hearing the name Queen. Queen is, I think that's supposed to be a name. Queen. Who is Queen? Queen. Queen. You are Esther. Come, come on. While you hold them, look, guys. Speak to them and let them. You will waste your time with demon spirits. Have a way of wasting people's time. Don't. You will save yourself a lot of energy. It makes no difference who is speaking. Queen. Who is queen? You are queen. I need to pray for you. You have a blood condition. Victoria. 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 I'm hearing the name Gabriel. Gabriel. Who is Gabriel? Gabriel. Please just save time when I mention your case. Gabriel. Gabriel is outside. Outside. The Lord is ministering to me. Outside. Gabriel, you are. Is it outside? Yes. Gabriel is outside. You are Gabriel. You are outside. Hallelujah. Come, my dear. What is wrong with you? I need to pray for you because the Lord is ministering to me. I saw this lady and I saw something that looks like a lizard and is sucking her blood physically. Look, come, come up. Look at this girl. Look at her. You will know that this girl doesn't look healthy. You don't even know what. And the Lord just opened my eyes and I saw something like a lizard just leads to her heart region and is just sucking her blood. This is how somebody just gets up and just dies. What happens to you? Your chest region. That devil is a liar. You'll be free. Hallelujah. There's no time to minister to your individual needs. Are you following me now? If God gives me a word for you, I'll just pray. Otherwise, 
Ah, okay. come, 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 come. You must be set free now. Hold my hands. Out! Come out of her now. Out now. Blessed is he who comes. I set you free from this captivity. Be free now. Praise the Lord. I'm going to pray for you. Who is having serious abdominal pain? You're having pain, just your stomach region here, very seriously. One of you here, because I'm feeling that same pain, so I know. You? Let me pray for you. But, but that's, that's not really the major thing wrong with you. What's wrong with you? bring you the power that is in the name of Jesus. Lay your hands on your stomach. Be healed right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I pray for all of these people. As I lay hands on you, it doesn't matter what the situation is. In the name of Jesus Christ, I set you free. In the name of Jesus Christ, walk into the blessings and the promises of God. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, be set free right now by the power of the Holy Spirit. Be set free in the name of the Lord Jesus. Um, the Lord is showing me about three people. There's a severe skin infection that is you have done all you. It's a very serious thing. In fact, it's even embarrassing. It's even embarrassing. There are three people. This is one. There's there's, there's two more. Please quickly. It's a serious thing. You have you have prayed about it. You have used drugs. Nothing has gone. Please. I'm seeing three people. It's time for God to set you free. Don't worry. If there are still more people you can connect. I'm just telling you the one that God is showing you. I don't care what it is. We sang that God will set you free. Please don't come out here to try God. It will leave. I don't care what it is. hallelujah thank you jesus please those with peptic ulcers just get ready all kinds of ulcers we're going to pray for you now please make sure it's, it's only skin infection only skin infection hold my hands madam i set you free in the name of jesus be free now be free now in the name of jesus be free now in the name of jesus as i pray for you just go back to your seat oh, the power of god is strong on my hands be free now in the name of Jesus, I cause that spirit be free now. In the name of Jesus, let him go. I set you free. Be free now by the power of the Holy Spirit. I cause skin infection in the name that is above all names. Hold my hands. Look at me. Look at me. I'm seeing you tied. Not only are you I pray that God will visit you in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, let her go free in the name of Jesus. Let her go free right now in the name of Jesus. You're suffering from any kind of ulcer, any kind of ulcer. We're just flowing as the Holy Ghost is, is ministering right now. There is a lot to be done. So please, ulcers, ulcers, God is ministering to me. visit your people oh god these are the ones that you died for look how many people are inflicted by ulcers i'll pray for you very quickly please i want you to believe as i lay my hands on on you the power of God will come upon you and you'll be free. Just begin to breathe in. Some of you will feel because the Lord is opening my eyes and I'm seeing it. You will feel something leave you. Just come out of you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Be free now. Out! Come out of her! Now! In the name of Jesus. 
out out of her thank you Jesus Christ be free right now out out please as I pray for you check yourself he's able out come out I will pray for you and I will talk to you in the name of Jesus Christ I set you free by the power of the Holy Ghost I set you free by the power of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus Christ I set you free be free now in the name of Jesus Christ be free in the name of Jesus Christ he's able bring the lady shout in there say he's able let her go in the name of Jesus I set you free by the power of the highest God is able. Command that spirit of infirmity. Leave her right now. Never to return. Be free now. In Jesus' name. Complete freedom. showing me someone you came here i'm seeing someone in your family lying down on the bed it's like a terminal disease that's one of the major reasons why you came here the lord is showing me is a woman i think your mother someone's mother lying down the bed who is that person i'm seeing someone on the bed and it's a very serious situation please who is that let's save time we have to really really be fast there's a lot to do who is that person please if you are the one just find your way quickly so i can pray with you Who went to Shika and came back? Shika and came back. Because this person I'm seeing, they took the person to Shika and brought the person back. You? My mother has one being in Shika. She went to Shika. What are you coming out for? Why is the man insisting that is the one? What is it? You came from Shika. You are coming from Shika. What's wrong with you? This one is a woman who is not you, but anyway, what's the situation? But it's a, no, no, no. What, what? Just straight to the point. What happened? My body is very hot, and the, the head is turning me like move. I want to fall. This is the spirit of death now. You would have died before today. Hold my hands. I want to pray with you. You'll be free now. Thank you, Jesus. I set you free. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. 
What couldn't you do before? Ogasa, what couldn't you do before? What couldn't you do before? What what is it that you could not do before? Okay, come, climb. Let's see if you feel weak again. I'll pray for you. Just just walk. Let me see. Try to jump. Any weakness? Don't worry now. If you want to jump, you'll fall. Shabi, I've prayed for you. Fall and die here. Jump. <laughs> Any weakness? Any weakness in your body? Try it again. Try it again. Look at this is somebody that came. He said he went to Shika. Huh? Are you sure? Don't pretend though. Are you feeling fine? You are completely fine. You are here because I saw the spirit of death. Your own is not just sickness. Lord, it is perfected in the name of Jesus. Please take on your shoes. Hallelujah. The Lord is showing me somebody with a condition. Is this my left or right leg? This is left. My left leg. I don't know if it's a, if it's a bone condition or a pain that you have in there. Please, who is that person? The Lord wants to heal you right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. You're the one? Oh, you can see it. You can even see it. What's the problem? I actually played football. You're a footballer? I had a fracture for eight months. You have a fracture. Now, on the leg, there is a fracture. Is it true? Please make sure you tell us the truth when you come here. Look at me. Watch yourself get healed now. Come. Don't close your eyes. Open your eyes. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Aya. The Holy Spirit. Young Gicho wrote a book. He said, The Holy Spirit, my senior partner. Watch what happens to this guy now. My brother, look at me. You are an adult, so you will not tell lies. Right? Watch. I don't want you to miss your miracle. Where is the fracture? Exactly. All right. Watch what happens to you now. Lay your own hands there. The hands you'll be using every day. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. You sense what is happening to you right now. Are you seeing this? Look at what is happening to him. You see the power of God? You see the power of God on him? He's laying hands on himself oh, and he cannot even stand again. That's the end of it. Stand up. Stand up. Jump. Do what you couldn't do. Just do it. Test yourself. Look at this. Look at See the guy is even rejoicing. <laughs> this is somebody with a fracture, fracture on his leg. Come on, give Jesus praise for an onion. See, there's no, there's no pain. Try doing like this. Do like this. That's how you know whether there was pain or not. Look at, look at, look at what you did. Come on, give Jesus praise. Hallelujah. God bless you. It never returns. Your leg. Come, 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 come. Don't worry. What's the situation? Yeah, pain. pain there. Let me see. Just, just the, no, no, no. You don't need to lift your. Just that point. The joint there. How long? Since two weeks now. Two weeks. What happened? Just like that, you woke up, and the pain refused to go. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Which one do you want? You want to lay hands on yourself, or I should just pray? <laughs> huh? All right, but seriously, let's pray. Hold my hands. Heal her, Lord. Set her free right now. The power of God is coming upon you, that leg. In the name of Jesus Christ. No pain. See, that's the power of God coming upon your leg. Check yourself. Check. Honestly. Check yourself. Look at The power of God is moving strongly. Check. Check. Do you feel any pain? You feel any She's even surprised. No pain is. Give Jesus praise. That devil has gone never to return again. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Goodness. The Lord just showed me a mighty miracle that has happened now. Someone you have a hole. You used to have a hole in your teeth. Check it now. You will not see that hole there. Please check it and come out. This is a miracle that has just happened now. Please, I'm going to start praying in mass for people. But you will be very surprised. When, when that happens to you, just come out quickly. The Lord, once God shows me something, he has done it. Please check yourself. 
check yourself we are not faking this thing here make sure you check yourself you will be very surprised to find out that there used to be a hole and that hole is closed hallelujah let me pray for you your mother your mother let me pray for you father in the name of jesus let there be healing for your mother wherever she is let there be healing for your mother in the name of jesus why did you come out for your mother hold my hands father for mommy we pray let there be healing and perfection in the name of the lord jesus christ please make sure you only come out for the cases i call why is he out eh? okay let me pray for you father for the mother we agree right now let there be freedom in the name of jesus look at this look at the miracle your teeth is closed now come come please we need a witness we need a witness is it true don't tell lies here you're in the presence of god where is it sorry can you open your mouth for me to see i'm sorry i'm sorry i hope that's not let me see you used to have a hole please come whether come and check no let's have any independent person so that you don't say we're acting this thing now come come and check check if there is any hole are you are you seeing that there's no it was really paining me when i it was paining you when you came here the hole has been there who knows about it only your sister knows about it and it's and you've been healed any pain now thank you jesus we give you all the praise in the name of the lord jesus christ hallelujah praise the lord now please stand up everybody i want to pray for eye conditions now let's just flow the way god is Please, if you have any problem with your eye, just lay your hands. There will be healing miracles right now. There will be healing miracles right now with the eyes. Immediately, I pray for you. Some of you, the power of God will touch your eyes. Just check yourself. And when you find out that there is a miracle, I want to take a few testimonies there. Please lift, your, lift one hand and place one hand on your eyes. Jesus will give you the praise. Hallelujah right now in the name of jesus christ i rebuke every kind of eye problem in the name of jesus i cause cataract in the name of jesus glaucoma i cost you now in the name of jesus short-sightedness long-sightedness be healed right now in the name of jesus by the power of the holy ghost i command to be healed and every spirit of blindness every spirit of infirmity every kind of blindness whether in one eye whether in both eyes i rebuke you right now i command be healed in the name of jesus be healed in the name of jesus now check yourself please check yourself check yourself god is doing great miracles check yourself check yourself check yourself hallelujah while they are doing that the lord is showing me people with heart conditions heart conditions you have a heart condition whether a hole in your heart or any kind of heart condition please can i have those people heart condition you've been diagnosed medically to have a heart condition you have a heart problem who preparing to go to india for is preparing to go to india for surgery what of you yes sir. what of you 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 have a heart problem since when did you know about it february the doctors told you what did they say is wrong palpitation palpitation oh. doctor doctor where's that doctor in ushers you are the one self oh yeah Ogasa, what does that mean doctor tell us Huh? Say she has palpitations. Abnormal beating of the heart. Ah, okay. It's loud and you can hear it even when she is. So it's a, you stethoscope, you can hear it. So it's a serious situation. She will be healed now. You're a doctor now. Wait. You go to hospital tomorrow. But for now, my dear, do you believe Jesus will heal you completely? Lay one hand on your chest. Lord, let her be healed right now. The power of God is flowing through you. Just breathe in and out. 
Thank you, Jesus Christ. Be healed right now by the power of the Holy Ghost. Be set free. Please check yourself. Lord, have mercy on the Father in the name of Jesus. How do you know now? Try it. Breathe in and out. Let's see. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Let there be perfection in the name of Jesus. Let there be perfection. The devil wants to bring stroke as I just held you. Huh? Is that true? You're already feeling half of you. Some okay, you're that too of stroke. Because immediately I had I held your hand, I just saw stroke. Father, we rebuke that stroke in the name of Jesus Christ by the power of the Holy Ghost. Be healed right now. We are going to rebuke delay in marriage now. Rise up on your feet. The devil is a liar. Please rise up on your feet. Some of you are smiling. That means it doesn't concern you. Because those who it really concerns is a serious issue. Praise God. Hallelujah. Now, I'm going to pray for you. Please follow me, guys. Hallelujah. Most marital delays are demonic in nature. And we're going to arrest it right now. You can stand in for yourself. You can stand in for your loved ones. Please lift your hands, everybody. You'll be amazed at what will happen right now. Everyone, please lift your hands. You can stand for yourself. You can connect. Hallelujah. At the count of three, I want you to shout that name, Jesus. Father, I pray that as they shout that name, every every demonic force that has held anyone's marital destiny goodness i sense the power of god in the name that is above all names father i pray that as your people shout that name i tell you many of you the power of god will rush like fire on you in the name of jesus every wicked manifestation of spirit husband or wife any spirit entity that cleaves itself to anybody as you shout that name by the power of the holy ghost their activities end now one two three i cast those spirits in the name of jesus let god's people go in the name of jesus out of them now by the power of the holy ghost inside and outside i command those powers to let you go now release their marital destinies now release their marital destinies now every cause that stops marriage in families in the name of the lord jesus i arrest it i arrest it by the power of the holy ghost we are still going to shout that name over this case the lord is not done yet lift your hands again i want you to shout it at the top of your voice and as you shout that name the fire of the holy ghost will hit you like a tornado god is visiting situations right now thank you jesus one shake it two get ready now get ready with your hands lifted three be released now be released now be released now i command chains chains marital chains be broken by the power of the holy ghost i command chains be broken in the name of jesus be broken in the name of jesus be broken let marital doors open in the name of jesus 
I prophesy over your marital destiny in the name that is above all names. The Bible says, seek out of the book and read. It said, none of this shall fail. None shall want her mate. Ladies, wherever your husband is, in the name that is above all names, I call him into your life. I call him into your life. Listen. Not a man, your husband. Not a man, your husband. May he come into your life in the name of Jesus. And I prophesy over our brothers in the name that is above all names. That sister that God has destined for you, we release her into your life now. Now, now, hallelujah. Now, I'm going to pray for all sick people, especially those who have come from everywhere. While you come out, do you have your prayer request? Please, if you don't have it, it's time to begin to write it now. For all those who are sick, you are sick in your body, you came specifically for healing. It's your time now. Please come out please come out come out just come and stand here everyone sick everyone sick inside and outside just find your way and line up here ushers just arrange them quickly stand here believing that god will set you free He that comes unto God must come believing. I want you to expect the power of God to come mightily upon your life. Whatever the situation is. I'm going to lay hands on every one of you and as I lay that hands upon you hallelujah I want you to expect the power of God to flow into your life whatever the situation is hallelujah worship team lead us in a powerful moment of worship hallelujah Lord we give you the praise thank you for healing in the name of Jesus those of you who are sitting please write your prayer requests once you are done just begin to pray in tongues and then we'll do this very quickly My God is awesome. In the name of Jesus, he in the name of Jesus Christ. Heal now. Heal now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hide me from the rain. I cause everything that is not of God. My God. Out. My God is awesome. Heal now. When I'm broken. Strange in the name of Jesus. My God is he, he can move the name of Jesus. Strength for you. I cause sickness. I want you to believe that God is setting you free. My God. Heal. The name of Jesus. Be healed, mommy. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Out of her now. From there. 
My God is thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. He can move mountains. Be healed now. Please, while you're seated, just pray in tongues. Shape a lot of us. Hide me from Jesus Christ. My God. Jesus Christ, awesome be healed awesome. in the name of Jesus Christ. He is awesome. be healed now awesome. by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, awesome. be healed. Awesome. Perfection. My God now. is awesome. In the name of Jesus, awesome. perfection in your body awesome. right now. In the name of Hallelujah. Jesus.
Job, please stand up. Please, I want you to believe. I want you to believe. Hallelujah. I want you to believe as I pray for you. I'm just flowing as the Holy Spirit leads me. There are people who came here tonight and your, true, your sincere desire is that God will visit you. Hallelujah. Please lift your hands. Promotion neither comes from the east nor the west in the name that is above all names. I pray may the lord give you a miracle job in the name of jesus i speak it and i prophesy it may my god give you a miracle job in the name of jesus as you are lifting up that hands let an anointing come upon that hand keep it lifted please that hand that is lifted i pray let an anointing come upon it the oil of gladness that sets you above your equals receive it in the name of jesus everywhere you have submitted your cv i pray may my god cause them to visit you in the name of jesus and every power that is stopping your job in the name that is above all names second the four horns that lift up themselves against judah against jerusalem against israel i command right now let those doors of jobs be opened supernaturally in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus christ hallelujah please everybody stand submit your prayer request do we have it this is a very prophetic moment we have a few minutes but this is where everybody gets to receive please i want you to be very very sensitive if you've not submitted your prayer request please just do that quickly this this just dedicate yourself to these few moments because they are very very prophetic what we're about to do any more people please quickly we have a God that answers prayers here so ta 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 ba la da 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 ba hallelujah this is the second time god is giving me this instruction usually we just pray on it and once we are done here but this is the second time the lord is telling me that i should take this request with me and i should pray over them through the night there is a God that answers prayers. And Hezekiah took the threat letter to God before the altar. He said, Lord, behold their threatenings. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Now we're going to pray. Hallelujah. These requests 
represent impossible situations for some hallelujah situations that only the power of god can change there are some situations here if we have to read it even we the men of god will be discouraged because of the kind of request that's why we don't bother reading it we just drop it to the one who created the heavens and the earth i want you to know that within these few minutes i want you to pray from the depths of your heart and those following us online now is the time for them to connect hallelujah because as we pray over these requests the power of god will turn these requests into testimonies in the name of the lord jesus we're going to pray pastor alpha come femi come benga come just pray lay hands on this and prophesy stretch your hands everybody towards this request and begin to pray begin to pray and prophesy hallelujah Zekata baba baba kata praga de baladarash. Zekate prondo koso praga de baladarash. Sete pro shapara da baladarara. Zekate baladarabos. Everybody stretch your hands and begin to declare and say, Lord, whatever I wrote here is turned into a testimony. Zekate ta 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 pakata. Rapaka pro so so pretekate Sidebo shobro dos coprendecate Shekata tate baladara Shopro doko to pregade baladara bosh Lord in the name of Jesus By the power of the Holy Spirit Change this situation Change this situation Sekate tate 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 Rekete boko to preke de banana bos Pataka pa pakate E preke te leke te So te ke te pros E preke te leke te 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 Reke te reke se E pros to pro to super high Leke te banana bakata preke de banana bos In the name of Jesus We turn this to testimony Jesus Lord under this corporate anointing we release answers to this request we release answers to this request let them receive emergency attention of heaven now in the name of Jesus we release answers now in the name of Jesus thank you because we got nothing shall be impossible and thank you for the release of the harvest of the seed in Jesus name we pray hallelujah please everybody stand those who are visiting with us all those who are who came from outside Zaria please come out I'll minister to you now I want you to come out expecting the Lord there are so many people who have come from different places please just come out sit up I'll pray for them and I'm going to pray for everyone for a release of fresh fire and fresh unction hallelujah it's not enough to come and watch miracles hallelujah but you are going to pray that you carry this anointing hallelujah and you represent the kingdom thank you so much for those who came Lizzie and her friends thank you so much all the way from Abuja thank you Pastor Alpha all the way from Kogi State Eddie from Joss Lunging from Abuja, I see a number of people. Hallelujah. Please, I want you to believe. I don't know what you came here for, but I really want you to believe by the power of the Holy Ghost. I want you to believe. I'm going to minister to you. Two things will happen to you. Whatever situation you came here trusting God for, I'm going to release my faith with you. And secondly, that you will carry an anointing. I tell you, something will come heavy upon your life. You will carry an anointing. You will carry an anointing. You will carry an anointing in the name of Jesus Christ. Just clash the cymbals. Please play strings. Strings, strings, strings. In the name of Jesus. Anoint them in the name of Jesus. Be blessed. 
take an anointing back be blessed in the name of Jesus be healed be blessed take this anointing back take this anointing in the name of Jesus Awesome is your name. Walk in greater levels of power. Greater levels you of power. Mighty, in the name of Jesus. You do glorious things. Your faith. Take an anointing. In the awesome name of Jesus Christ. Break through every closed door. Do I open it now. By the power of the Holy Ghost. You do glorious Take this anointing with you God. in the name of Jesus awesome to your locality. Today. Do mighty things for the King. I release your marital destiny. This is what the Lord is ministering. I release your marital destiny. In the name of Jesus Christ. Take this anointing. Oh, In the name of Jesus. I open every closed door. In the name of Jesus. I open every closed door. Let the fragrance of the Spirit be upon you. I command breakthrough. I hear my spirit breakthrough. I release breakthrough. Breakthrough by the power of the Holy Ghost. I command breakthrough in the name of Jesus. I command breakthrough. 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 Financial breakthrough. God is bringing you financial breakthrough. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Rababa Shatabanana. Let the world grow. In the name of Jesus. Let the world grow. Let an anointing come. Greater apostolic signs. Greater apostolic wonders. Awesome is your name. Awesome is your name. Closed door that I see in the name of Jesus. I open this closed door that I see by the power of the Holy Ghost. Take this anointing that it makes you mighty. Supernatural breakthrough by the power of the Holy Ghost. I cause that spirit that limits you. I cause that spirit in the name of Jesus. Please, everybody, stand up. The time is against us. Please, everybody, rise. I want to do an impartation right now and then I'll just prophesy on our lives. Please lift your hands. Something will come upon your life. Hallelujah. This is where certain people will receive something. 
I want to impart the gifts of the spirit. I already sense a strong atmosphere. Lift your hands in the name of the Lord Jesus. The healing anointing is going to come on many people now. Take it now. Take it now. Take it now. The healing anointing inside and outside. Take it now by the power of the Holy Ghost. Take it now. Take it now. Go and heal the sick. Go and heal the sick. You will lay hands on the sick and they will be healed. You will cast out devils. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Receive it. I pray. I command the prophetic. Let it be activated now. Prophetic fountains be open now. Visions, dreams. I command in the name of Jesus. Receive it. An unction. You don't need to bring them out. You don't need to bring them out. We activate it. Take it now. Supernatural experiences, dreams, visions. Sopotopate. I command leadership mantles. Leadership mantles. Take it now. Take it now. Take it now. Strong leadership mantles. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Hallelujah. Stop la cambre de gelaba. I'm about to pray the nine gifts of the spirit and many more listed in the Bible in the name of the Lord Jesus. At the count of three, different gifts will be activated in people right now. One, two three receive it word of knowledge word of wisdom prophecy tongues interpretation of tongues take it now i activate the full power of the spirit i activate it inside and outside take it let the holy ghost come upon you in power receive it receive it Gifts of healing, word of knowledge, gifts of prophecy. It will come like fire. It will come like fire. It will burn you. It will come like fire. It's the fire of the Holy Ghost. The fire of the Holy Ghost. Hey, Anana, Shinana, hey, hey, Rama, Shinana, Nana, she Bari Adabash, she Bari Adabash. Two of you, hold your hands, hold your hands. Take it now, she Bari Adabash, she Paya, Maka Pregede, Mekeri Aba. Take it now, Rapa Bashata, Kapa Tataba, Rapa Te, Empregede, Reke Kashopa, Mambra Teketa. I activate the gifts of the Spirit every apostolic ministry in this place take the fire take the fire take the fire every apostolic ministry take the fire every prophetic ministry take the fire take the fire take the fire hallelujah there are many of you who are kingdom financiers financial apostles everyone will be blessed but there are specific people lift your hands my god i pray that these people let an unction my god my god my god my god take it financial dominion by the power help them help them help them 
Shetete, take it. Ideas, I activate it by the power of the Holy Ghost. Financial apostles, arise, arise, take the kingdom. Sekete, rekete, rekete, tete, maka prateke, empletos kepa, matos kopo rekete. Sekete, baka bada bada. Now I want to prophesy very quickly. Please, I want you to shout Amen. Every closed door over your life, in the name that is above all names, be open now. Be open now. Be open now. Every closed door, be open now. 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 I pray right now. Every opportunity you have lost, I don't care what it is. I prophesy right now. Receive restoration. Receive restoration by the power of the Holy Ghost. Receive restoration now. Receive restoration now. Hallelujah. Every family under captivity and hardship in the name that is above all names, I command those families to be free now. Be free now. Free from hardship. Free from hardship. The Bible says to appoint unto them that morning Zion. I pray whatever made you cry this month in the name that is above all names I cause it to its root now. I cause it to its root now. I cause it to its root now. I pray everyone who has the key to the next level of your life, every destiny helper, I don't care where they are right now, in the name of Jesus, like Prophet Ezekiel, I call them Matebalaya. He said, I prophesied as I was commanded. Destiny help us arise, come forth. Destiny help us arise, come forth. Destiny help us arise, arise. Hallelujah. Wherever you have faced resistance in your life may this favor anointing in the name that is above all names as i prophesy right now let that favor anointing hit you like a tornado go back to where they rejected you and watch my god make a way for you i command favor i command favor in the name of jesus whatever has been speaking against your life and your destiny let the blood speak for you now let the blood speak for you now any terminal disease here any terminal disease here we terminate it once and for all in the name of jesus every dying destiny every dying destiny like the bones in the book of ezekiel hear ye the word of the lord whatever you have that is dying whether it's your business 
whether it's your family whether it's your relationship whether it's your marriage i come with a prophetic voice share ye the word of the lord come alive now come alive now come alive now come alive now i prophesy that by the next miracle service you will return with a change of garment that everyone that sees you will know that my god has visited you every ministry every fellowship every group every church every assembly represented here i pray let an unusual unction rest upon your ministry everything you see happening here go and reproduce it in the name of jesus i release upon you that power in the name that is above all names whatever has stopped your church from growing whatever has stopped your ministry from growing i command ministry grow church grow in the name of jesus hallelujah lord we give you the praise i'm going to make an altar call right now if you're here and you've never given your heart to the lord jesus please listen this is a very serious moment we're out of time you've never made jesus lord of your life inside and outside you probably were invited you may have been a christian but you've never truly declared the lordship of christ i'm going to invite you to come here or you've been born again and you found yourself derailing this is the greatest miracle please everybody rise just one minute just to encourage those who are coming out please let's rise right now you belong to that category you are saying lord i return to you i don't care whether you've been born again before please i want you to leave your seat and come out right now leave your seat and come out right now you want to make a decision you're making a decision for the lord jesus for the first time please listen or you've given your heart to the lord but you found yourself backsliding don't wait for anybody you are the first person please appreciate them i believe there are people god bless you god bless you thank you thank you thank you they are coming koinonia celebrate them inside and outside thank you for the courage we salute your courage god bless you god bless you keep coming keep coming it's a new day it's a new season you are saying goodbye to yesterday and god gives you the gift of tomorrow to remedy for the mistakes of yesterday thank you jesus for these ones keep coming keep coming god bless you no matter how far keep coming don't be afraid don't be ashamed of anybody it's a personal affair tonight thank you jesus hallelujah i salute your courage for those of you who took out the time to come lift your right hands and from the depths of your heart you're not reciting a poem i want you to say after me lord jesus i love you and i believe in you i believe you died for me i believe you shed your blood to set me free i receive that freedom tonight and i receive eternal life into my spirit in the name of jesus from today i declare that i'm born again i'm a child of god holy spirit come and live in me i make up my mind to live for jesus all the days of my life forward ever and backward never in the name of jesus christ thank you so much for making that decision let me pray for you father preserve these ones you brought them out by your power preserve them in the name of the lord jesus may your christian experience be authentic in the name of the lord jesus thank you so much for making this decision where are they following okay you have a gentleman just lead you that gentleman waving his hands please just follow them they'll have your details and you'll be back to your seat celebrate jesus hallelujah please all those worshiping with us for the first time if this is your first time attending any of our meetings we love you we celebrate you please rise up on your feet and just come out here koinonia celebrate them all who have come from far and near 
this is your first time you are very very welcome celebrate them appreciate them thank you for coming thank you for coming thank you for coming thank you for coming we celebrate you we honor you no matter how far come there is a blessing for you there is a prayer for you the lord brought you here to bless you thank you so much koinonia is this the best you can do lord jesus we thank you for bringing these ones hallelujah hallelujah thank you so much for coming all of you who took out the time to come we really celebrate you we appreciate you hallelujah this is koinonia ministry put a uh, program put together by eternity network international thank you so much for coming we are here every friday not this exact venue but every friday as god grants you the grace you always be a blessing having you around praise the lord we have a blessing in the house and this is the gift we release to everyone who comes and i want the saints of god to stretch their hands and just bless you i want you to receive it please bless them professor you have a blessing upon your lips i want you to speak it we bless you let the hand of god be strong upon your life in the name of jesus we bless you with hunger for the things of the spirit we bless you with passion for god in the name of jesus we bless you with advancement we bless you with favor we bless you with speed in the name of jesus may you experience the power of god strong in your life we bless your finances let the heavens be open over your life in the name of jesus thank you again for coming we love you and we celebrate you now we just like you to follow the ushers that gentleman waving his hands and they welcome you more warmly on our behalf celebrate them. dearly beloved i hope you were blessed by this message i want you to keep doing something for this man of god our man of god apostle joshua Salmon. And that is, I want you to keep on praying for him that the cause of the gospel may have free flow in him, that he may be granted boldness to continue with his commission of Jesus Christ, and that all provisions be given unto him as he continues in this journey of Christianity. And then, don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you are new here. Don't also forget to leave a comment in the comment section and then keep sharing, keep sharing abroad and let's all keep sharing Jesus. I'll see you again. Bye.